This is new surveillance video right here tonight of an East Providence neighborhood. Police believe a person in a hoodie is connected to a string of car break ins. I'm Mike Montecovo. And I'm Shannon Heggie. It happened early Monday morning between 3 and 4 a.m. This is in the Kent Heights neighborhood. One vehicle was stolen. 12 News reporter Amanda Pitt spoke with the residents who captured some of the surveillance video. She's live now in East Providence with more. Amanda. Well, Mike Shannon, police tell me that more than a dozen cars were broken into in the span of about an hour. One car was even stolen. All of them were left unlocked and police are now combing through surveillance video from residents trying to find who's responsible. It's been a quiet 23 years. For more than two decades, this East Providence resident has called the Kent Heights neighborhood home. Monday morning, he was woken up by something out of the ordinary. When my phone went off at just before four o'clock in the morning, I got up. And I started looking out the windows and I didn't see anything. So I went, that's when I went to the phone and I looked at the, the, the video and I saw him walk right by the front door. I said, well, it's four o'clock in the morning. He doesn't belong here. His phone notified him that someone dressed in a sweatshirt with the hood up walked right by his front door, heading straight for his family's vehicles. He tried my granddaughter's car and uh, that was locked and my wife's car was locked. My neighbor across the street, his car was open and he rummaged through his um, work clothes, work gear, and just left everything. The person did get into his car, stealing a flashlight, and into surrounding neighbors' cars, stealing things like gift cards, old debit cards, cash, and even loose change. Another neighbor reported seeing two people on their surveillance video rummaging through cars, then driving away. It's like it is now, like you see it now, it's quiet. Even at nighttime, no problems here, until some guy just has nothing better to do and start stealing things. East Providence police say over a dozen cars in total were broken into. Every single one left unlocked. There was even a report of a vehicle stolen, later found unoccupied by Providence police. This resident hopes whoever it is doesn't come back. If I found him, he would have gotten hurt. Because I'm now stay off my property. Now, if you're an East Providence resident and you notice anything suspicious in your neighborhood, you're urged to contact police at 435-7600. Live in East Providence tonight, Amanda Pitts, 12 News.